You know, on January 4th, 2011, I was, again, homeless and penniless and hopeless in some people's eyes. And when I got the call that they were looking for a homeless guy with a, a golden voice, I had no idea, really, who they were talking about until someone called me and told me, it's you that they're looking for. Your video went viral. Again, I don't know uh, what to make of that because I wasn't familiar with viral videos and I didn't post that video and I knew nothing, very little, should I say, of the internet and all. And next thing you know, I'm on the Today Show with Matt Lauer and Meredith and all of those great people. And all of a sudden thereafter, I'm on one of the leading doctor shows on television. I mean, the cameras, the lights, I've had all of the networks around the world. I went from homeless to Hollywood. <laughs> I went from drinking rot gut to gray goose in a matter of minutes. Overwhelming would be an understatement. Let's just say I was paralyzed with fear. I was paralyzed with, with uh, success. I just didn't know what to feel at any given time. My emotions surfaced out of nowhere. All through my homeless days, I never cried. My father died, I never cried. Here, I get to this point, and it seemed like everything that I should have and would have cried for surfaced, and I just became an emotional wreck. I, I feel like it was really too much too fast. I mean, hey, giving me a job would have been one thing. Ted, you know, you've won this, you've, you've got that, and thank you so much. I would have, I'd have been satisfied right then and there. When people see me, they see an act of God. Yeah. They also see that God is still alive and he's still working modern day miracles. So that I really do feel that he who was homeless will lead the homeless home. I don't want people to think of me as I left this earth that I was a crackhead. I want them to, to see the impact. And I want my grandkids to look on YouTube and see some of the things that their papa was proud of that did. And, and I, I'm not going to sell myself short for anything because God gave me this for a reason. And that reason is to be here to talk to you, to tell you to keep me in your prayers. This is Friends of the Homeless. It's a shelter that was here when I needed it. One of the big things that I know that many of these guys suffer from, as well as me back in the day, was socks. We didn't have any. Today, I'm going to give back some socks. All right, Daddy, I mean, love you, brother. Love you. You know I love you, man. I was right there at the head of the line waiting for my hand down. So this is where I have a lot of loyalties now. <laughs> it's just exciting to meet the people and to embrace them with hugs and all of that stuff because they know that I was just five years ago in the same situations that they were. Five years ago, I held a sign that said, I have a God-given gift of voice. I'm an ex-radio announcer who's fallen on hard times. Please, any help would be greatly appreciated. Thank you and God bless. You know, if I was asked to rewrite that sign today, it would say, I have a God-given gift of voice. Acknowledge him in all my ways and he will direct my path. Thank you and God bless. Hi, YouTubers. I'm excited to give you an update about our own YouTube channel. Now you can find new videos every day. They're the kind of videos that will make you look at life differently. They may even make you laugh a little bit. Who doesn't need a daily dose of that? So here's just a taste of some of what you'll see. Subscribe to the OWN channel today, and we'll see you on YouTube.